Hey guys, Greasy Bear here, and I want to talk to you about the new K-Pack kit I'm releasing today. It's called Greasy Bear's GB Tech Inserts, and each of these inserts have an emission shader attached to them. So I kind of want to give you a brief description and show you how to use these inserts and adjust the emissions on them. So let's get started here. I'm going to make a cube, and I'm just going to, you know, blow the cube up a little bit. I'm going to make it a, put a a material like a black material with a little bit of shade on it um, go to my dev mode turn my over overlays off okay so first of all I'm gonna go to my kit ops and I'm gonna load my GB tech inserts and let my thumbnails load uh, each one I said has an emission on it so you have the right to take the emission off or change the color or adjust the emissions so I'm gonna show you how you do that so I'm going to add an insert here. This one has two emissions on it. Um, I'm going to add another one. And let's see, this one has uh, one emission on it. So, and then I'll throw like a, I'll throw like a vent. I also have a vent. I'll throw a vent in here. So, yeah, kind of cool, right? Like that, right? So, okay, they look cool. Right on the inset, they're good. They're not like decals. They don't, they're not flat at all, but they're kind of like decals, but they're not flat. So they show detail in every angle that you use, which is kind of cool. So the next thing I want to show you is you take the auto select insert off and you select the base of the unit. You go to your materials list and it'll show you the colors that are here. Like I said, this had two emitters on it. So one's gold, one's kind of blue. So you can either take them completely out by zero, zero out, the strength and then just use the decal on its own um, and then you can possibly take the decal and come up to the mat or come up to its texture and change it to like the background of the cube to match and then once again bring your emission back in say you want to bring this one in and I like it like red or something yeah it looks kind of cool and I would just leave the other one out you know um, this one over here the same kind of deal you can just click on the uh, it's, this one has two sets on this material, so basically you can just grab it, change the color to your desire. You can bump it up, make it a little bit stronger, or use the decal as just a blank decal and take all, all the emission setting off it at all. So, yeah, that's looking cool. <clears throat> so anyway, I'll put the emission back up a little bit and, uh, you know, make the color like, I don't know, like a blue for this, something like that. And then... Uh, once again, down here, just click on the base in the, in the materials list. It'll show you the color, the emissive color. Just go in and change it, and you're pretty much done. And that should do it, you know. And this pretty much works for every uh, every one in the kit except for the cutters uh, and obviously the two decals. Um, but they're all totally adjustable. Um, and yeah, that's about it. So I hope this video works for you to show you how to change the emission colors and use these properly. And I really hope you enjoy the K-Pack and I appreciate all your support and time. So thanks for watching the video and take care. Bye-bye.